Welcome to our family time. Good afternoon. Welcome to our family time. Good afternoon. We're so glad you're here. Daily vlogs. So if you like this video, we hope you'll come back tomorrow and hang out with us again. I might get my age of 10 pass right now. You don't convince me. Barely. Barely. We're getting one apple for them. And maybe a pumpkin fish. <laughs> it's as big as your face. <laughs> it looks not so fresh, but it looks delicious. It's really good. There's so many thumbnail opportunities in this clip right here. <laughs> so we decided one of our finances in line. We're getting my pass today. Will we get an annual pass or a discount? We can ask. I don't think so, though. It's our first time being annual pass. We holder, don't pay for parking, though, during it, so that's good. Sure. Because that's what we did that last is, year. <laughs> I truly have a feeling because there's so many like sets starting to pop up for Halloween Horror Nights that I've just seen online that this is going to be a vlog of Peter losing his mind. So prepare yourself for that. Wow, wow, wow. The tickets at the whatchamacallit, what you call it, ticket window are $20 more than they are online, so Peter just bought his Halloween Horror Nights pass online. Oh yeah! And printed it here! Boom! No costumes, no masks allowed, valid September 6, 7, 8, 12, 13, 15, 18, 19, 20, 22, 25, 26, 27, 29, October so 2, 3, 4, 6, 9, 10, 11, 13, 17, 18, 20, 23, 24, 25, 27, 28, 19, 30, 31, November 1, 2, Peter Brookout Photo ID Ride, Halloween Horror Nights. I need to ask you a question. 29. What does that entail? So the Frequent Fear Plus gives me every night except Saturdays, but it does include the first and last Saturday. The first two Saturdays and the last Saturday, but no Saturdays in between. So Thursday, Friday, Sunday, Monday. Lots of dates. Let's go into this park. You just got in with this new card. I think this was the first time you came in with the new card. Well, here's the thing. I got my new card because I messed up and I used my thumb rather than my finger because I wanted to reset to use my index finger. But I didn't bring my card today, so I used my app, and my app still has both of those cards on there, so I don't know which one is which. So I tried using one with my index finger, didn't work. Used my other, other card with my index finger, it didn't work. So then she's like, well, let me figure it out. And I was like, wait, try this. And then scanned it, and I used my thumb, and it worked. So I don't know if I just reset my new card to a thumb, or if that was the old card that's still active somehow. That was our whole point of getting a new card. We'll so. figure it out. We'll figure it out. Oh, I just got my Halloween Horror Nights Freaking Fear Plus Pass, and now we're about to see some scare zone decorations right there. Vanity Ball. Sarah? What did I tell you? Literally, we walked in. And Sarah says, This literally might be enough for me. This might be spooky enough. It's freaky. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that stage. Look at those colors. Those look like ghosts. Oh. Because it's Halloween Horror Nights. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I think they're making fun of either Merida or Lord of the Rings over here. Look at this scare zone. They're not making fun of it, it's just creepy. Look at the font, look at the font. I know, that's historical, don't, that's not don't, don't. Disney. <laughs> that's pretty creepy. Someone's gonna be up there being real scary. The creepy potion. And I'm sure that wall comes out and it's gonna jump out of that hole. And there's skulls in the trees. And creepy lanterns. S'mores fries. Wow. It's the evil guy from Ghostbusters. And, and this pizza is pizza fries. Pizza fries in there. I've only had pizza fries once and they were not good because they were old. But maybe one day I'll try them again. We came in to get some AC. And this is maybe one of the most magical places we've ever been. We got Jellyfish Fields. Oh, gosh, Squidward's house. Gary will be alright. Look at Squidward's house, Spongebob's house. I think Gary's in Spongebob's house. Oh, good. Phew. Gary, oh, you are changing colors in this. What? Uh, it's the jellyfish party. Oh, it is? <laughs> this is awesome. Um, I think, I think I need both of these shirts. See my point? Snackertarian. This is one of the coolest stores we've ever been in. I click unlike on everything. <laughs> and also this mug. 
I would get rid of a mug to have this in my collection. Um, what's Rugrats doing here? This is SpongeBob's land. Nickelodeon. What, what, what? So, Sarah and I are, don't try to be things we're not, and we don't keep up on everything theme parks. I had no idea. Did you have any idea you could do this? You can meet Patrick and Scooter. I've only been over here like three times, and it's strictly for HHN reasons. 15 minute wait, not too bad. We have not been on this ride since our very first time here. And I like, I remember it, but like it was just like such a chaotic day that. And it was the very, I think it was the first, was it the second attraction we did? Because we did Diagon Alley. First. And then we left because we knew we wanted to come back to it. Yeah. So I think we came over here because I was like, oh, there's nothing else over here but ET. We went to Men in Black and then this. I don't like Men in Black. I don't like Men in Black either. It's I get too sick. spinny. Um, but this will be interesting. I know this is like a, a universal smell that everybody loves. The doors are opening. I'm sorry, but I just, I'm giddy with HHN energy. I'm not surprised. Here we go. We got our pass, our extraterrestrial passes. Oh. This reminds me of the Stranger Things on the house from last year. And I'm just so happy. It's E.T.'s teacher. I've never seen that before. What'd you think? So fun. I always forget how nice that is. Peter has never seen E.T. Whoa, you gotta confess my secrets out here in the world? I barely saw E.T. because my older sister was super, super Let's afraid watch it this of weekend. E.T. So we couldn't even speak of it in our home. <laughs> um, are you right. trying to be Woody the Woodpecker? Because you look great. Are you a sketchy or real? Just hanging out. Okay. You would think if I was brave enough to steal spoons from restaurants that I would just walk over and look behind these tarps because just behind those tarps, the signs of those houses are there, Sarah. I just want to go reach behind and peek. Do it. I don't get kicked out before it doesn't even start. What if they ban me for life? <laughs> They're probably practicing. They are! So this is my favorite part of Halloween Horror Nights is the Academy of Villains because it's all dancing and I get to edit it fun and pray that Peter doesn't get called up on stage because I even get nervous and I'm not even there. <laughs> Ooh, ring, ring, God. It feels so good. And it's, it's only a... super hot today. I'm like, but how, how long this wait is? 15 minutes. Look at that, 15 minutes. And I believe it because we're not even stopping in the lobby. Can I have some money, please? Thank you. Can I have some jewels? Thank you. Can I have some rubies? Thank you. Can I have some rupees? Put a comment down below if you know what that reference is about. How did you get in here? We have changed. Well, listen, don't let me keep you from your tour. I just need to pick up a few things and I'll be on my way. You haven't seen me. That was exhilarating. There were dinosaurs, or a dragon at least. There was wizards and warlocks and trolls and witches. It's so soon. Spooky, spooky. Oh, I can't wait. Spooky, spooky for real. This is the Rob Zombie oh. area. Guys, gals, goblins and ghoulies from last Halloween. I will scream like a little baby. I will cry like a little baby. And I'll have fun like a little baby. <laughs> oh, people are ranting and raving about the Rob Zombie Spears. Look at this. Oh, look at zombie hippies. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. Ooh. Ooh. Look at the creepy skulls. Creepy skulls. Creepy skulls. Creepy skulls. Creepy skeleton. Super creepy skeleton. Creepy stage. Creepy, someone's gonna be up there screaming at me probably. Tell me what to do. No, thank you. It's creepy, creepy, scary skeleton. Yeah, but it's gonna be concentrated, like lots of spooky stuff going on in here. Well, there's a coffin over there with a very nice paint job on the inside. And whatever this is, it's like a throne. Someone's gonna be sitting there yelling at me again. They're like cloth skeletons. That doesn't make sense to me. But I'm sure it will, 
Oh no. You're gonna get someone. Ooh, you're gonna get electrocuted. I wonder if I'm gonna get electrocuted. Sarah's song is on. That's some more. Yeah, That's I do like some more. Reminds me of my grandmother. Yeah. And my dad at the same time. Yes. <laughs> Well, this part, ding a ling a ling. Wait, okay, there's something over here that's definitely for a scare zone, but I'm scared. I don't think, no, they're definitely not gonna put people on it, but I'm scared oh, zombies. Be... Okay, this is super deceiving. The bright colors, the friendly looking whale, whale on specific treasures. I don't trust this more than I can even look at it. That little weasel. Yeah. That's gonna be something spooky. And then over here, it's called zombie kill. What is that? Zombie kill of the week. Oh, there's definitely gonna be zombies on that. And it, it looks like they're gonna bring people on stage and I'm definitely gonna try to do that. I'm gonna do that. And then there's two more houses over here that are usually really good. I don't like that it's saying that girly man would do really low. That's annoying. Sarah figured it out, guys. Sarah, I figured, figured it, it out. out. This is gonna be the double zombie land double tap. Scare zone. Oh. Freaky. Where are the what are the other rules? You think they're gonna be running around all in there? Yeah. So we are gonna hop over to Islands of Adventure real quick to get our pumpkin fizz because it's fall. It's fall. It's pumpkin spice latte day, but the is it pumpkin spice latte day? Like it, it started today. Like everyone went and got one today. To think, I used to thrive. There was at least two years in high school where like I woke up for this day. <laughs> um, I never drink coffee, so it's not that big of a deal, but I love a pumpkin. Love fish. a good pumpkin fish! Woo! That you missed! So <laughs> oh yeah, Christmas time! Christmas time! Christmas time is here! Woo -hoo! Christmas it time! It smells like Christ bacon! Christmas time is here. We made it to Hogsmeade. Pumpkin fizz is like the pumpkin pie. I just picture us hanging out here with our teenage kids and it's going to be so much fun one day. Yeah. And um, the Hogshead is the only place you can get it and it is the Superior theme park drink. We decided to take a sit. We never like actually sit and chill in here. Oh, it's so go. detailed and so gorgeous. Look at all the, the antlers behind here. Wow. So this is the three broomsticks. Pumpkin fizz in hand. Got an HHN Plus in my pocket, a pumpkin fizz in my hand. It is fall. What did you just do? I caught you red handed. <laughs> she just took a big old whip or something from this kind of cart. She opened up the malt, I malt love vinegar. All vinegars, especially malt. Took a big old whip and it was too much. But before we leave, I'm going to show you this adorable photo. Not photo, this adorable painting. Look at Buckbeak. Look at that's gorgeous. Did you enjoy your time today? I did. Are you more hyped than ever? I, it finally is setting in that Halloween Horror Nights is so soon. I can't believe it already. And I can't believe we're annual pass holders and I get to go a million times this year. Yeah. And I can't wait to scream along with you guys the whole time. Right. Shout out to Doug and Ray for being amazing and for just Helping hooking us. us up this year. Yeah. Changed our lives. Sarah was super serious about watching us so much that I'm running to Redbox at 7-Eleven. Hopefully they have it available and maybe I might run in and get some snacks since Sarah's not with me. Shh, don't tell her. It may be Tuesday night. That doesn't mean it can't be a movie night. A, a, a movie night. What, what? Today is August 27th. Last Tuesday of the month. Today is by Haruki Murakami. As time goes on, you'll understand what lasts, lasts, what doesn't, doesn't. Time solves most things, and what time can't solve, you have to solve yourself. So we watched Us. Um, did you like it? Yeah. Was it spooky? Yeah. Um, My girl, I started it again. <laughs> yeah, Elizabeth Moss. Um, I liked it. I don't know if it was as, like insanely amazing as like oh what I know a lot of people made it seem like I think it's just like one of those like mind benders yeah the ending was a twist so that was cool 
Um, and I would like to see them make like another one in that universe. So. I feel like it's less freaky in my head now because before I didn't know the concept. So like now that I know the whole universe, like that is a little bit more like less like believable. But not believe like. But like, more scary this for could uh, happen. Halloween Horror Nights house, right? Yeah. But I don't have to have go fun. in. It's good to be Why home. Why didn't they hire me to be the girl? You should have. <laughs> it's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are. We know what we hope to accomplish. And believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>